Bye, cutie. Have a nice day. I come back soon. Sleep well, you pretty. <laughs> Hey friends, I hope you're all fine. I just have this microphone because I'm not sure if you hear me with the camera tone. It's very loud here with these rivers. <laughs> so I went into the mountains today, into the Alps. <laughs> and I just want to spend some beautiful time alone here, filming and slowing down a little bit. And I just thought I'd take you along. For me, as a giant introvert and nature lover, there is nothing more fulfilling and beautiful than being alone in nature. And that's what I'm doing today. What does being alone mean to you? Being an introvert doesn't mean that I don't like or need the company of other people. It's just that being alone gives me energy and time to reflect, structure my thoughts and make plans to build my dream future. I really need much time on my own. Otherwise, I feel more and more stressed until I'm completely drained. When I was younger, there was a phase in which I was convinced to be an extrovert, as I always needed to be with people. But that was just not true. that I was afraid of my thoughts, so I didn't want to give myself time to think. But I also felt miserable the whole time, because I avoided the me time I need so much for being happy and successful. It was a vicious circle. The key is to always strive for balance. And that balance is totally different for every individual. So don't copy other people. Listen to your own intuition. <laughs> you always know what you need most. Prioritize your needs over anyone and anything else. 
It's your time on Earth, so you decide what to do with it. The time you lose, you will never get back. I met not a single soul in this wild Bavarian mountain landscape. It was perfect. Nature also had some gifts for me. Besides joy and inspiration, also something tangible. I found lots of babolite and porcini mushrooms. When I came back from my adventure, it was nearly dark. prepared these fresh forest mushrooms for lunch. Job. And you have way more waste than parts you can use. But I see it as a form of meditation. It takes a long time and I enjoy working with my hands. Have a 
beautiful week, friends. I'm looking forward to chat with you in the comments.